prone hamstring flexion with tibial rotation. So we use the prone position for multiple reasons. A couple being when you're on your belly, you can really get some feedback of your pressure in your chest, your hips, to see if you're compensating into your low back. And the second one is it brings you into some hip extension because we're gonna do the knee flexion down at the knee. And so the idea here is when you add that tibial rotation, you get even a little bit more hamstring recruitment at the knee and that ground gives you feedback to see if you're compensating. So when you go to the ground, I like to lay flat, resting my forehead on the ground. I like to think about pushing my palms and head through the floor, bracing through my midsection, squeezing my glute, and then I'm gonna rotate my foot out, pull it to my butt, heel to butt, come back down, and then I rotate foot in, pull heel to butt, and lower back down. When I do that, I'm trying my best not to let my hip take over, and rotate in and out. So if I face away from the camera, you'll see, rotate the foot out, pull heel to butt, come back down, rotate in, pull heel to butt. And I'm trying my best not to have any of that rotation like so, keeping the knee being the one that's doing the bending.